Hi Capricorn, this is my channel Psychic Love Tarot. Welcome to my channel. On this channel, I do tarot readings for the people from all around the world in English language. So please subscribe to my channel. Right now, I'm going to do a reading for Capricorn people that what will happen from 15th of January till 31st of January 2023. What I'm going to do is first I'm going to pull out a cross spread from this tarot deck and we'll see what will happen overall. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some cards out for your love life. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some extra messages for you uh, from uh, Lenormand cards. Uh, so uh, watch the video till the end so you get all these messages. Uh, let's start with tarot. Okay. Messages for Capricorn 15 to 31st of January. Messages for Capricorn 15 to 31st of January. Messages for Capricorn 15th to 31st of January. Messages for Capricorn 15th to 31st of January. Okay, Capricorn. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So the first card in the middle we have is Four of Cups. So Capricorn, right now you are a little bit dull, low or nothing Nothing much is happening or you're not uh, taking any action. You have some uh, options or offers around you, but you're not interested in those options or offers. So it can be in work, it can be in love, it can be in any area of your life. <coughs> Sorry. Maybe uh, you were rejected in something or you rejected something or somebody. Uh, but you still have your eye on some other opportunity which you want. But that's not here yet. Before that, we have King of Wands. So uh, I think you were being a little bit... Uh, I don't know, strong, trying to be strong, trying to uh, get your way or something like that. And um, it's like uh, you were passionate to take action. But then I think nothing, no action has happened or maybe some action happened and then it stopped. Uh, in the mind space, we have two of pentacles. So... Uh, you are weighing your options right now. You are comparing one option to the other. You are juggling. You are juggling in your head those options or those offers you have. And um, you have been uh, through, uh, like going through some rough times before. Uh, and um, now you want to be careful about... Uh, uh, choosing the option or offer. Underneath we have Ace of Pentacles. So for some of you, you already have made a decision and you have started something. There is a beginning. And uh, if you have not for some of you, then you are uh, you want to start now. You want a beginning now. Uh, yeah. And you want a stable beginning. You don't want anything... Uh, which is compromising or not uh, stable. You need, you want stability. Now moving forwards, we have Ace of Wands first. So there is going to be a very passionate beginning uh, in the second half of January for you. Uh, for some of you, this beginning has already begun. And um, uh, you are going to be very passionate and uh, things are going to move forward in a very positive way. And uh, there is going to be a beginning definitely in some area of your life and you're, you are going to be excited about it. Then we have four of swords. Uh, for some of you, there can be a little bit of low energy. Uh or maybe you will uh, start something in some area of your life and in some other area of your life, 
maybe you'll uh, calm things down or you'll take a break from something else some uh, for some of you it's like that and for some of you maybe you'll uh, be yeah passionate start in something but you'll also be resting or uh, i think you you will be taking a break from something something else in your life uh, because you'll be more focused on this new beginning maybe this new beginning this new start uh, something like that yeah now let's pull some cards out for your love life okay love messages for capricorn 15th to 31st of january love messages for capricorn 15th to 31st of january love messages for capricorn 15th to 31st of january love messages for capricorn 15th to 31st of january Okay, Capricorn, one, two, three. Okay. So, first of all, Ten of Swords. So, I guess worst has already happened. Something ended uh, in your love life or something uh, was went really down your some of some kind of a relationship or something really uh, for some of you it ended. And for some of you, it really went in a down phase. But the good thing is that um, it uh, uh, the worst has already happened. So now it's it's a ten. So whatever is happening after that is good. Uh, first of all, we have justice. Uh, so I guess justice will be served in your love life, and there is going to be a, a, a decision you will make or it will be made mutually and uh, things will move forward in a very fair way. So, uh, of course, different for different people, different situations. We cannot pinpoint that. But there is going to be a decision or maybe you are already uh, in the middle of that decision. Uh, so, something is going to be implemented for some of you, you maybe you'll cut out from the past person, cut your ties from the past person, past situation which was not serving you. Or for some of you, maybe a new start in the existing situation which was which went bad and now it will revive in a very positive way like a reconciliation or healing the relationship. Because after that, we are ending up in Knight of Cups. So everything is going to be all right in your love life, Capricorn. And that's going to be really romantic. The second half of January for you is going to be really romantic. Uh, for some of you, it will be a new situation. For some of you, it will be romance in the existing situation that will heal, that will work out. And eventually, we have Ten of Cups in the background. So it's going to give you, uh, so in the second half of January, basically, you're going to be really happy and emotionally satisfied. So your love life is going to uh, improve in a very positive way uh, in the second half of January. So overall, it's very positive, uh, Capricorn. It's good news for you. Now, let's pull some extra messages for you from Lenamand deck. Okay. Okay, what else for Capricorn? 15th to 31st of January. What else Capricorn? 15th to 31st of January. What else for Capricorn? 15th to 31st of January. What else for Capricorn? 15th to 31st of January. Okay, yeah stock so uh, some situation in your life is definitely gonna improve and uh, it's gonna go to the next level it can be a love relationship it can be a job it can be anything it will upgrade to the next level in a very positive way some of you will move uh, maybe move your house or change your job or something like that for some of you, it's going to be like that. Some of you can get pregnant. 
not everybody of course but for a few of you it's a pregnant pregnancy energy or delivering a baby kind of thing okay what else for capricorn 15th to 31st of january okay yep ring so some of you can get engaged some of you can get married or some of you can get uh, like decide to get married decide to get engaged or decide or or maybe a commitment with somebody so maybe your relationship will uh, ascend to a higher level uh, of commitment uh, and uh, there can also be uh, like um, you can get engaged uh, or married or decide to do that uh, to get married or engaged uh, for some of you, it can be a work contract, a business contract, uh, some kind of written contract, legal contract you'll be signing for some of you in your work. What else for Capricorn? 15th to 31st of January. Okay, you're going to leave something, mice. Uh, you're going to leave something which... Uh, is making a mess some situation which is making a mess or uh, which has created some problems in the past i think you're gonna cut ties cut out ties with that situation uh, that problem or that situation so please hit the button like if you like the video and give me a thumbs up you can subscribe to my channel if you like what i do and thank you so much for watching the video stay blessed always